caught in the crossfire. It's caught in the crossfire. Hello there, and welcome to another video. Not so long ago, I gave an unboxing of this coffee grinder, and it's actually really good. So you can see now it's at home, and what I've done inside here, if I just take this off like that, you can see, not very clear, sorry, you've got some coffee beans. I haven't filled it so much. Yeah. Here, because it's only me who drinks coffee, I just put it down to the minimum of two. And here, on the side, I just put it just past medium. You can see down this bit here, it says coarse. And then that down there, you can't see it, it would say fine. And all you need to do is to press this button. And I will do some now. I've got the coffee in there. Going to press it, go. switched itself off so it's so easy to do <clears throat> I actually do have coffee in here so there's more than there and it just pulls out like that there you go I'll do it again here pretty easy yeah. all comes out and I wish you could smell that but there we go there's the coffee as simple as that and oops I'm just going to put the lid back on there and then I just scoop that out and then put it into the coffee machine here. Pretty simple stuff, yeah? And I think it's good value for money. A top tip, this one, don't put so much coffee into it, yeah? Just put in maybe like quarter of a bag, maybe like 100 grams, for example. It does say 200, but I think it's actually easier and it doesn't, it seems to make less noise. Like, noise if you have too many coffee beans in there. So maybe like a third, maybe half of a bag is going to be ideal. So there we go. There's a review of this beautiful coffee grinder. Do like, do subscribe, do share, yada, yada, yada. Bye bye. And I'll see you for the next unboxing and the next review very soon. Bye for now.